Force India Chief Operating Officer Otmar Sazanawa has accused certain team bosses of deliberately fooling the gunning body, the fear, into increasing the fuel limit to gain a competitive advantage. A 5 kg increase to the maximum race fuel load, taking it to 110 kg, has been agreed by the Formula One strategy. Group and F1 Commission, leaving only the FIA World Motorsport Council to ratify the rule change in the 2019 regulations. The rationale behind the tweak is to improve the show by reducing the need for teams to save fuel during the race, enabling drivers to run flat out for the duration of a Grand Prix, but Suzanne Auer derided the reasoning as curious, instead contending it will have no effect on racing other than to benefit teams running inefficient engines, that's a bunch of nonsense, said in incensed Suzanne Auer. Realize that it's not at every race that we can't go to the end with 105 kilograms, this is only an issue at a few races, and we always lift and coast, we always save fuel, even at those races where your capacity isn't the limiting factor, we will still save fuel if the quickest way around to the end is to not put as much race fuel in, I think it's just wrong. I think they fool the fear and liberty, media, and what they're really trying to do is regain that competitive advantage that Mercedes has. That's what it's really about, Suzanne Auer said the real aim of the teams lobbying for change is to level the playing field in favor of engine manufacturers able to extract less power per kilogram of fuel, an area in which Mercedes has excelled in. The current turbo hybrid power unit era, therein lies the question, if you don't do a good job, should you work harder to do a good job within the rules that everyone agreed to or should you change the rules, he asked rhetorically. I think it's wrong.